Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. Well, we'll see temperatures slowly back off through the 30s this evening. Some rain showers initially, and then as the air gets a little colder tonight, uh, back over to some of those snow showers for a little while. And then uh, snow showers early in the day tomorrow, 35 degrees, transitioning over to rain showers before ending around lunchtime or into the early afternoon. And then we'll even see the clouds break a bit, and we should make it into the upper 40s later in the day, but still well below normal. So rain showers back to snow showers tonight. Little or no accumulation, maybe a trace of snow. We're not going to get that organized several hours uh, snowfall like we had this morning. And then some morning snow and rain showers tomorrow on Tuesday. Breezy and chilly with the clouds breaking, clearing out tomorrow night. That'll even set the stage for some frost uh, Tuesday night and into Wednesday morning. But by late at night and into the morning hours on Wednesday, clouds will be increasing again. And we'll get back to mostly cloudy skies. But the good news for you uh, people who are fed up with winter. How about some summer weather this weekend? We're expecting temperatures in the 80s. And today at Dayton International, 2.3 inches of snow, 31 hundredths of an inch melted snow and rainfall. And now we're up to over 16 inches of snow for the snowfall season. I don't know if we're going to get any more measurable precipitation after this. There is, I suppose, maybe a, ten, a chance for a few tenths tonight and tomorrow morning. Last year, if you think, well, this is unusual, we, on the night of the 20th to the 21st, we had 2.5 inches of snow at the airport, picked up about 4 inches in Centerville and the latest three inches or more April 21st 1901 we had three and a half inches then here are some of the snowfall totals from our weather checkers David Wessler inch and a half in New Paris uh, up in Brookville, Jason Thompson at 1.3, Vicki Sifke in New Carlisle about an inch, and Bill Telsro a little over an inch of snow. Just a trace reported by the Lowsteaders in Jamestown. Live Doppler 2 HD, we're tracking rain showers coming back into the area tonight. Could have some snow pellets mixed in too, especially seeing some of the darker green out in central Indiana. And farther north and west, another disturbance dropping southeast. That'll bring us a few more snow showers later tonight and tomorrow morning. We'll see lows tonight, low 30s up north near freezing. Southern part of the Miami Valley, low to mid 30s, about 33 in Dayton. And then highs tomorrow afternoon, mid 40s north uh, to the upper 40s to near 50 across the southern half of our viewing area. You can watch the time lapse on the Goodwill Auto Auction camera. Cloudy skies, of course that snow falling this morning but quickly melting. And right now we're at 39, a west wind at 15 miles per hour. 82% the relative humidity with a wind chill of 31. Rain showers back to snow showers tonight. Cloudy skies, snow showers tomorrow morning over to rain showers before ending. As the clouds break, we clear out tomorrow night. And then those clouds start to roll back into the area on Wednesday. Your forecast tonight, rain over to snow showers, breezy and cold, low 33. Uh, maybe a light dusting of snow. Some morning snow showers tomorrow changing to rain showers. Clouds breaking in the afternoon and breezy with those winds out of the west northwest at 10 to 20. Some morning frost Wednesday, but a high near 60. Up near 70 on Thursday. We'll have a chance of some showers Wednesday night and early Thursday. And then a chance of thunderstorms with a stronger warm front moving through on Friday 70. And behind that front, low 80s for high temperatures over the weekend. Rain chances late Sunday and Monday.